Hey guys, so today I'm going to be telling you a story. I haven't filmed a story time video in quite a while, um, but this one I just had to share with you. So I was over at Chris's about a month ago, I think, or maybe two by the time this video goes up, and we always go to this restaurant, well, takeaway place, because you can't really sit in and eat it, um, that serves fish and chips. And it is like the best fish and chips in London, and it's just, Oh, it's just beautiful <laughs> and they've never delivered to where Chris's house is even though he is technically in the area that the restaurant is in if that makes sense so the restaurant has a radius of where they kind of take the deliveries and Chris is literally just on the outskirts of that even though they're quite close to where the restaurant is Anyway, so we've always known they've done delivery, but we've always driven there, picked up the food and then come home. But this time we looked online and it actually delivered to his house. And we were like, oh my gosh, this is great. Let's just order the food and it can come to straight to the door instead of having to drive out and pick it up, which was just like great. So we ordered what we wanted, which we usually do the meal deal as it's called. And it's two haddock and chips for like, 16 pounds or something it used to be cheaper and then they upped up the price anyway so we ordered what we usually have and this was at about 20 past seven i think because we'd been out somewhere i don't remember where we'd been but we'd been out and we were like really hungry so <laughs> we wanted to order food quite quickly and it got to about 10 to 8 and it said that the food was being sent out and should be with us by about eight o'clock I think so it got to eight o'clock no sign of the food and we we're a bit like right okay so Chris tries to call the number for the delivery man and it doesn't go through <laughs> so we're like right okay maybe it's just like dead and switched off or something so we call the restaurant and they say that they've just sent off the food literally like five minutes ago and that it should be with us within 10 to 15 minutes and we we're like okay that's perfect so it gets to about quarter past eight and we've still not got the food. <laughs> At this point, I'm like so hungry and I'm one of the girls who, when you get hungry, gets angry. So I was hangry at this point, <laughs> which is never good. So we rang up the restaurant again and they asked if we'd called the delivery man and we said yes and the phone call wasn't going through and they were like, hmm, okay, that's a bit odd. And they were like, oh, maybe they, he should be there soon. So then I was thinking, oh my gosh, what about if he's been like attacked or something or had an accident? Because on, I think it's Uber Eats we were using, you can track where the person is and it moved like a little bit, but it wasn't moving. So I was like, what about if something's happened and like, yeah. So I felt bad, like maybe he'd been in an accident or something. And then it got to about 20 to nine and we were like, okay, this is ridiculous. We've waited over an hour for this food. It was sent out like 40 minutes ago. What is going on? So we called up the restaurant again and they said, yeah, well, we've actually had problems with this delivery man before. And I was just sat there like, and you're still using him. Like, what? How does that make sense? And they were like, yeah, um, we had a, another issue with a customer and him earlier today. And I was just sat there like, oh my God, we're not getting our food. He's run off with our food. What, what, what? I was just like in denial at this moment in time. And I checked my account cause we'd done it on my account and I'd been refunded. So he'd canceled the order, but we didn't have our food, which meant he'd clearly taken our food. The delivery man, took our order. <sighs> I was so annoyed. And we were like, well, what can we do about it? And the restaurant said they didn't have any more of the food that we'd ordered. So they couldn't like send out more. I was so angry. And they were like, there's not much that we can do because you've been refunded, like you're not charged. And I was just like, but we haven't got our food. And I was so hungry. And it was honestly the most ridiculous evening in my life. <laughs> and then we were trying to contact Uber and complain. And they were like, well, we can't do anything because you got refunded. And I was like, that's just disgusting. One of your employees has stolen our food and you're saying you can't do anything about that. Like, 
that's really, really bad. So I'm not gonna be ordering from Uber Eats anytime soon. And then to top it all off, we decided to order from a different restaurant because obviously we were so hungry and I don't think Chris had any food in his freezer. So that's why we were ordering food in the first place. It took over an hour still for the food to arrive. So it was at this point, it was like 11 p.m. And I was just like, I just wanna sleep. I haven't eaten dinner and I'm annoyed. I'm, uh, yeah, it wasn't good. We did, I can't remember what we ordered in the end. It wasn't fish and chips. Oh no wait, it was fish and chips. It was more expensive fish and chips and it wasn't even good fish and chips. <sighs> I'm getting angry thinking about it guys. Like it was just annoying. Can you imagine ordering food, it not arriving and then realizing your delivery driver has stolen your food? Who does that? Like, so that was a story time that I wanted to share with you because I just thought that was quite a funny slash annoying story and situation that I needed to share with everyone. And I haven't done a story time in a while. So there we go. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new, subscribe. I'm gonna go out and enjoy the sunshine cause it's very, very hot. And I'm wearing my nice cute little Bershka top. Uh, not the shorts today, but I really do love this outfit that I've got on. Just saying. I'll see you next week for another video. Bye.